Welcome to subnet in example 1. Nice and easy, which subnet is host 192.168.100.59.27 in? Now we know traditionally, although classes don't really exist anymore, that a class C address must have at least uh, three, the first three octets for the network. So three lots of eight bits gives us 24. Now we've got a slash 27 here, so to get from 24 to 27, we add 3. So let's tick down 3 in the subnets chart there. That's the subnets column. That tells us that the last octet would be 224. Now they're not asking us in this um, to answer this in this part of the exam, but I just wanted to demonstrate how the chart works because it helps you quickly answer those sort of questions. So from the host bits we've stolen 3. We've ticked down 3. So let's tick across the top row three. Whatever we tick down, we tick across. So that's one, two, three, to give us 32. The increment for our subnets is 32, and we're subnetting on the last octet, because that's where we've stolen our bits from. So our subnets will be going up in increments of 32. I'm writing it out as well for those that don't have the sound on at work or whatever. So we started off at zero, so it'll be 192.168.100.0 and then dot .32 and then dot .64 and you'd go all the way up until you reached subnet 224 which is another handy reason why we write it out in longhand so we can see what our last subnet would start with. Now in the exam we just want to get to the answer as quickly as possible and then move on because of time. Um, there's no such thing as extra marks for adding other bits that they didn't ask. So we're looking for host number 59 and you can immediately hopefully see that the answer's popped out right in front of your eyes. It can't be the zero subnet, it can't be the 64 because that's too much. So 59 host, the host 59, must be in the dot .32 subnet. In the exam, tick that as the answer, which it will be one of the answers, and then move straight on to the next question. So you've got lots of extra time. You should actually be looking forward to subnetting questions because it's so easy in the exam. Just for your information, I'm going to show you the hosts. 32 can't be a host because it's a subnet. 59 is in there, uh, 62 is a host, and then 63 is the broadcast. All right, so that's the end of this example. Thanks for watching.